Hi everyone, I'm Jennifer Drennan. I am the librarian here at the Patrick J. Dowling Library located in the UICC, the United Irish Cultural Center of San Francisco. And I am so excited, I decided to try a live unboxing video um, because we, recent, we just received a brilliant donation. Um, I came across uh, a series of children's books that were written by a um, father and daughter uh, family in uh, Dublin, John and, and Kathy Burke. And she's the illustrator, he's the writer. So when I reached out asking how I could go about getting a collection of these books for our library here, because you know the one thing about donated books is children's books very rarely survive long enough to be handed down which is a good thing because it means, you know, the initial kids are reading them and loving them. But it means that our juvenile, you know, our younger readers collection is, is not as complete as, you know, we might like it to be, especially because so many new things have been published recently. So the publisher, um, which is Gill Commercial, Gill Publishers in Dublin, Ireland, not Dublin, California, were kind enough to send a collection for us when I explained that we were a special collection Irish archive here in San Francisco and that we would like to be able to include these works in, in our library. So at the top of the box is Constance Markovich. Behind me is a uniform that was recently donated to the library. Uh, it was worn here in San Francisco in the 1930s from the Countess Markovich Society. And we've been talking a lot about the rising and the, women, the men and women that participated in it, you know, with the anniversary just having been the end of April. And um, yesterday was the anniversary of some of the executions. So, you know, it's, a, it's definitely a topic of conversation that comes up this time of year. And so here we have for our younger readers, a book about this remarkable woman who certainly did not have to get involved, was the member of a privileged class and chose to get involved anyway. Also Granway, otherwise known as Grace O'Malley. She is uh, a 16th century chiefess <laughs> and brilliant woman who reportedly challenged Queen Elizabeth. Tom Green, who I'm gonna have to read about, but he is from County Kerry and he sailed with Captain Robert Scott in whose dream was to be the first to reach the South Pole. I may or may not have this correct, and you feel free to you know, gently nudge me in the right direction in the comments, but I think he might have been a member of uh, the Shackleton excursion. Michael Collins. Now, when I had reached out, I had just seen a couple of the books, the Michael Collins, the Constance Markovich. Um, and then when I looked at the publisher's page, I, I saw this entire collection. Mary Robinson, Brian Baru, and then this is just above and beyond anything um, I could have hoped for. The Irelandopedia. Get ready to go on an exciting adventure around Ireland. Unleash your imagination and sense of adventure as you discover Ireland like you've never seen it before. And it has an activity book. So we won't ha be having anybody write directly in this book, but we'll make um, reproductions available for people that want to use uh, the activity pages here in the library in conjunction with the book. The Historopedia and activity book. So also discovering Ireland, time travelers of any age will be totally absorbed by Kathy Book's detail, Burke, excuse me, detailed illustrations and her father's fabulous facts which can be found on every page. And again, there's a workbook for that. And then this is something that I think everyone who takes Irish language lessons in the area will appreciate. 
Uh, this is the Folklorpedia. So, uh, Folklore's uh, dictionary, Irish English dictionary, is one of the, one of the major editions that, that we hold here. But now this one is for language learners of any age who will be totally absorbed by Kathy Burke's detailed illustrations and her father's fabulous facts, words and phrases. Find out the Irish origin of place names throughout the county. Can you say what your favorite music is in Galga? Sort out your kamahad from your kanfa, which I probably just murdered terribly. And learn all the ways to describe yourself from your hair and your eye color to your personality and style. Spot a word for everything in your home, garden, and town. Learn to from karma. Come from. Anyway, clearly I need lessons. Make conversation with your friends. So I just cannot, cannot thank the Burks enough and their publisher for making sure we have the entire collection to share here in uh, San Francisco with our community. So whether you live here in the neighborhood or are visiting for the day, when we're open Thursday, Friday, Saturday afternoons, sometimes Saturday mornings, drop by and take a look at these wonderful new additions to the collection. And again, to the Burks, John and Kathy, and their publishers, Gill Publishing of Dublin, a huge thanks for this addition to the collection here at the Patrick J. Dowling Library. A donor-built, volunteer-run library of Irish arts, culture, and tradition, and, and California history as well. Thank you.